What's going on guys? Jay from MedSchoolInsiders.com. I'm out here at Cape of Good Hope, the southernmost tip in Africa. In this video, I'm gonna show you that med school isn't all work and you can actually have a lot of fun. Now, one exciting thing about medical school is that fourth year is usually pretty chill. More specifically, the second half of fourth year. During the first half, you do sub-internships where you go to other facilities, other hospitals, and work there for 30 days, acting as a medical student. You try to do as good of a job as possible because these are usually programs that you are very interested in and would like to do residency at. Now, after you submit your application in September and do your interviews in November, December, January, and sometimes even up through February, the rest of fourth year is pretty relaxed because now you just have a few prerequisite courses to take, but most people are able to take a lot of vacation time. And that's exactly what I did. So earlier this year before residency, I was very fortunate to travel all over the place and I had a blast. Now first, in January earlier this year, I went to another plastic surgery conference. My research was accepted for presentation and I was flown out all the way to Hawaii. This research conference was actually right in the middle of the interview season and I had a plastic surgery interview right before and one right after. So my trip was pretty short and I didn't have that much time in Hawaii, but I presented my research and then I got some time to actually enjoy the island. I went all around, seeing all the different sites, went to the Volcanoes National Park, and I did a full tour of the large island in just one day. It was exhausting, but overall a very, very cool experience. After I finished my coursework, I then had the opportunity to go on a proper vacation. My significant other and I went down all the way to Cape Town, South Africa, which is a hidden gem that a lot of people do not know about. This is my first time ever visiting the African continent, and it was a blast. Cape Town and South Africa as a whole have a lot to offer. We saw amazing views, we saw animals, we did a lot of sightseeing, we did paragliding. Overall, it was a blast. Funny enough, after spending 10 days in Cape Town, I flew all the way back to California because I had some work to do regarding the incubator organization that we started, as well as, you guessed it, Med School Insiders. So after one week in California, I flew all the way back out to Berlin, Germany, which funny enough is in the same time zone as Cape Town, and I met up with my significant other again over there, and we got to learn more about the history. Berlin was not, you know, a sunny place with beaches and, and great warm weather, but it has a very strong, pertinent history that's important not to forget. Not the happiest place, but there's a lot of culture there, a lot to learn, and it's a place that I recommend you visit, if nothing else but to learn from the strong, although saddening history, but I think in our current climate in the United States and in the world as a whole, remembering that intolerance is not okay and remembering the atrocities that have happened in the past and these lessons that we need to learn from, I think is very important moving forward. Fourth year is obviously the pinnacle of relaxation, vacation, free time, but all hope is not lost. As you guys recently saw, I went to Orlando where I presented some research at another plastic surgery conference and also got an extra day to hang out at Disney World. I'm going to be mostly busy with residency from here on out, but I definitely have a few exciting trips planned in the not too distant future. Let me know where you think I should go next, or tell us where you're going yourself. Whether you are in college, traveling before medical school starts, or if you're already a medical student who's planning your fourth year vacation time, let us know down in the comments below. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked the video, make sure you press that like button. Hit subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys in that next one.